Still a lot of questions, but we are getting answers. We're hearing tonight from the DA about her decision to not press criminal charges against KPD officers involved in Lisa Edwards' death. Good evening, glad you're joining us here for WVLT News at 5. I'm Ted Hall. I'm Brittany Tarwater. Thanks for joining us. District Attorney Sharm Allen is standing by the decision to not press charges against those officers, but she is telling us tonight that the officers did not act appropriately. John Pierce has more for us on this tonight. John, you spoke with the DA today. Why did she tell you that there are no criminal charges? Well, Brittany, it comes down to what was in the autopsy report from the medical examiner. Based on that information, Sharm Allen says not pressing charges was the only option. The medical experts that I have to rely on say she was not murdered. Knox County District Attorney Sharm Allen is standing by the decision to not bring criminal charges to the KPD officers who arrested Lisa Edwards for trespassing. Edwards refused to leave Fort Sanders Regional Medical Center after being discharged. Edwards later became unresponsive in the back of a KPD cruiser and died the next day. The release of the KPD body camera video has sparked outrage in the community, with people calling for the officers to be held criminally accountable. But Allen says she cannot press criminal charges because the autopsy ruled that Edwards died from natural causes, specifically from a stroke. And because of what the regional forensic center has determined from a medical standpoint, legally, I can't charge. The medical examiner found that at no time did law enforcement interaction cause or contribute to Miss Edwards' death. When we go in front of a jury, we have to say this individual, Lisa Edwards, was murdered. These are the people who murdered her. And I have to have experts to testify to that. I don't have any medical experts that will say she was murdered. In the KPD body cam video, we hear repeated calls for help from Edwards, who was discharged from Fort Sanders earlier that morning. Allen says she can't hold them criminally responsible. Certainly an officer's um, decisions as to medical condition would not trump um, those medical professionals at the hospital. Allen adds there is no state law that requires someone to render aid in that situation. I'm going to pass out. You're not going to pass out. Despite not pressing criminal charges, Allen admits the officers did not act appropriately. These officers did not treat Lisa Edwards with respect. They did not show any empathy. They showed no compassion. Uh, and I, like many, are sickened by the way she was treated. Now, Allen says despite how she feels about how the officers treated Edwards, she made it clear that's different than pressing criminal charges. She says those officers can still be held accountable in civil courts. That would have to be through a lawsuit from the family. And John, those officers aren't back on the job yet. Those KPD employees are still on administrative leave. Yeah, that's right, Ted. Still on paid leave while that internal investigation continues. All right, John Pierce, thanks.